Now, you know, Bible is good. Uh, in Aongea, in the beginning, he, where did sisters emanate from? It's because in the beginning, he made them male and female. Uh, I don't know. Uh, Genesis chapter 1 kind of gives summary of creation. Summary. Genesis chapter 2 gives specifics, the process. Genesis chapter 1 is like a statement. Eh? And akaunda. Actually, Genesis chapter 1, ikifika kule verse 26, inaanza sasa kusema, uh, in, a, in a summarized way, what did God think about wakati wa creation? Akasema, uh, and God said, let, let us make a man after our, in our image and after our likeness. Is that clear? The image of God is inside you. The likeness is what you express. Where we come from, Chana, there are two things you need to have. Daniako uko na sura ya mungu. Inje yako uko na mufano wa mungu. Is that clear? Now, um, ukiwa na simu ya Safaricom, it can only una Safaricom. It can only access network ya Safaricom. Kamana iko na card ya Safaricom. Let me tell you something sensitive. When you have the image of God and you keep it. I want to something. I wish to get one but but it's okay. There's something in uh, I don't know. Hiya, some here. What's the beginning of you? Is when God said, Let us make somebody, create somebody, and bow ni our image. Our and after, after, after means after means navy. Haya, kuna kitu kilikuwa bere yaka. There's something that pre-existed which is not being created. It pre-existed. So, mungu anakuunda kulingana na hicho kilikuweko. So, tabia ambao tukonaunda ni yetu. Hallelujah. Are you getting it? Part of, you, of what you are was not created wakati uliumbwa. It was imparted in this manner. Kuna maubiri ya inja, brother? Eh? Um, you see, we have some coverage. Ukiaza kuchukua hivo, tutaulizwa nani huyu aliba speaker. Nasiku hiba ni kubeba tu. Ati kuna dugu wa liiba speaker. Obalikiwe. Igina hawa tabeba. Wana zabeba speaker ya besha. Haya. When God says, natuube mutu kwa sura yetu. Iyo sura, sidikweko. Because you can't be made in his image an image that never existed. Is it true? Hmm? Hello, praise God. Master, do you know that? Kwamba sura hiyo, it was there. Now, what is likeness? Likeness ni hivi. Ni kile kilikuweko katika mungu. Because mungu akiwa hai, anatabia inaonekana. He can speak. He is intelligent. Akona akiri. Akona tabia. You know, living means characteristics of living aweza ongea aweza fikiria aweza amua so likeness ni character that you express from outside image ni hicho kitu ambacho kilitoka ndani ya Mungu kinaitwa his image 
Now, image hiyo haimaanishi we ni picha ya Mungu. Inamaanisha ndani yako kuna ingredients. Ambazo za Mungu. Let me prove something. Have you ever noticed wapendwa? Isipokuwa uchichanganye. Do you know if you concentrate na uwe very serious, you become great woman. Do you know problem yetu ni kwamba we never squeeze the image it okay. Do you know kiamua leo kuomba na kuwa kama prophet Daniel you can you can. Do you know ukiwa serious useme mimi nitakuwa professor utakuwa. Our, our difference ni kwamba watu watu wengi they never never produce the maximum image they never. Haya utajua hivyo. Haya I wish tukakuwa tunakaa na nyipa moja. Ni jua vura mnaamka asubuhi. If today ni kona shilingi 1111 ni wapatie ni I want you to be so serious. Na nikataka kuona faida hiyo pesa after a month. Kuna watu nikiwaita after a month hamtakuja utakuwa umekura yote. Are you understanding? Ukiamua we ukiamua shilingi yako 100 itazaa ingine it can happen it's possible no kiamua ukichwe if you are not so active and serious uchukue tu kule which means out of hard shillings you can become rich haya can i ask a question is poverty part of god's image no Watu wengi upenda kwa sababu ako chini kiroho eh uh, na uko chini kifedha do you know why you can change your family it's because you are claiming the image the other day ndiko America Texas na dada moja wa kanisa letu ako Texas ako na nyumba ambayo mimi sijaiona nimeingia hiyo nyumba nikashidwa now I, I can't compare this in the house in Kenya now akabia bishop si peke yake leo naiba wibo naonekana oh alirajua oh ni nyumba hiyo umeiona haya nitakuchorea now that lady namjua akiwa gong very hapo sister akora degree moja ingine na ingine na ingine she's always progressive Okay, bishop, it's not this one. I can show another one and another one. Juzi nimefungua nyumba yake hapa Nairobi. Ako na nyumba apartments very expensive. Now he is coming nifungue ingine yake. Ah, amenituma nimnunulia gari. I'm a bishop, I want you to get a better car for me. I'll be driving in Nairobi. But walipokuwa watoto, they were very poor. Walikuwa wanakaa nyumba 10 feet by 10 feet wakiwa watoto tisa. They were infected by jiggers. But can be bishop jiggers did not access our hearts. Yeah, kwa America dugu yake kwa Karen is rich. I want to tell the truth. Anybody who decides and take action can go far. Haya, skiza. Anybody ambao hamui na kuchukua hatua wewe kama msichana one day utagudua some somebody decided and in his decision he decided for you are you understanding unakuta kuna tabia uko nao hukuamua ni mtu mwingine aliamua akakuabukiza kwa maana hujaamua na mimi Uh, now niko kwa TV and I'm exposed uh, na kama kuna kitu nichukia nikiwa na 10 years is misuse of a woman i really hate it na nikiona msichana ambaye for me i can't imagine hiyo inanisubua kwamba ulitoa nguo mwanaume akaingia pale na wakataka I, I, mimi hiyo picha ukija kwangu sawa kile kinanituliza tu ni damu ya Yesu but sometimes i can't imagine ulitoa nguo ukakata migu hivi mwanaume akaingia akamaliza na akaenda mimi huona kama wewe si naona 
Najibu kufikilia. Kwa maana kama kuna kitu nilichukia niko mdogo ni fornication and misuse of a woman. And therefore tukikaa na wewe nione una hiyo tabia. I don't know what happens to me. I really hate you. Na nitakubadilisha. Praise God. Na why? Kwa sababu ukiamua kitu ambacho kinafanana na image of God unapata network ya mahali image of God ilitoka. I like to teach you that. Sometimes wasichana unakaa as if Mungu alikuuba akakuacha huku peke yako na akakaa binguni. Are you understanding? I have a question. Ukiwa na sima safari kom, safari kom haiko hapa. Naona wako restaurants na wako na booths whatever. But but kuna tambia ya ile card ya safari kom that connects it to their center and their waves. Do you know it's so easy for you to be blessed with everything. Na ukute, ukifika kuoa unaolewa. Ukifika hii unapata hii. Ukifika kama utajua. And, and I want to show you how, how things get destroyed. One of the things that in a ribu network is immorality, fornication. The moment somebody penetrates your body. Dea tuta okay hiyo kitu. Kuna kakitu watu wanaingia hapo. Simuko na ya. Na wengine yenu mutu. Kaina wakia vipaya. Simuwekine wenu yenu ilingiwa. Nita daktari mpimu wa kama muko vaji njini. Tukuta. Amia, nilini? 1980. Na wewe? Siku moja. Acha tu. Mungi analia. Na wewe? Mimi nisijui nakini. Nisijui kama aliingia. Ni kama tuwa lijaribu. Huku sikia kitu dani. Kama kuna kitu huharibu network. Ni fornication. I can show you how it does. Do you know what's China? You are the only people and by your sexual organ it gonna see you. Ya wanaume haina. Ispokuwa roho hapana kusaidia kujua ili ingi. Inaza ingia watu miyamoja na gini wa kutakakotu hivo. Yenu kuna hime. Why does God honor so much iyo kitu yenu kwa ba aliweka hime? Iyo kitu ufaja nifikiria sana. Sana sana na one thing that you notice praise the name of the lord if somebody broke your virginity what do you think happened when you gave your organ and somebody broke it i want to tell you something kuna network ilipotea the image of god in you and that image of god abaya akonai you lost network sio network ya maombi kai ni mwananyita si network ya maombi mwili mwili wako the way mungu aliumba na ukaweka himen there is with that image of god has network na ile image mungu mahali mungu alitoa that image there is there could a network na hiyo and when you broke your virginity kile mugu aliumba na order ya network kuna ni haribika because how can your sexuality have network na kile mugu alifikilia when upande wako the order imeharibika and that's why we tell ladies if you get saved na unajua you somebody broke your virginity you are supposed to claim secondary virginity ya damu ya Yesu to restore network munaelewa what i'm talking about that's very deep that's very deep try it oh yeah bwana inuliwe try it unajua vijana shida yenu and hi let me say this ukisoma ephesians chapter 2 verse 2 Utaona there are two centers za utawala. There is the prince of the power of the air and there is the right hand of God 
where Jesus is seated. Uh, either, and that's why if you read your Bible, Ephesians 2, verse 2, Utaona, the Bible says here, in Asema Hivi, these are the dynamics that Kiroho about us, Chana and Wavrana should understand. Uh, and you he made alive who were dead, who were dead, who were dead uh, in trespasses and sins in which you once walked, in which you once walked, in which you once walked according to the course of this world. I don't have, in Kiswa Sama Kwaba, Muritembea Kuringana na, there are two lifestyles, Kuringana na Ukawaida Waurimuengu, flowing with what is known as Ukawaida Waurimuengu. That also destroys network. Now, in other words, ilifika wakati, wakati was wana wanajaribiwa na masturbation. You did not resist it to keep the image of God. You just did it. Kuna wakati was chana unasikia yu kitu yako ni kama hasa I raised your sisters. Kuna siku katika saiko ya was chana ambao about three or four days about your organ in a skia kabiso taka sex. So, unajikuta some of the people ambao hawataki kutunza the image of God. If you masturbate, you are, eh? What are you doing? Unatembea kuringana na ukawaida wa ulimwe? If you check your Bible, Whenever you do that, Bible in a sema, eh, when you do that, who controls you? I don't know which Bible you're using, but I'm using New King James Version. When you check Ephesians 2 verse 2, Gina according, 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 kuringana, imerudu wa marabiri. I don't know whether your Bible is going to that, that, Oh. <laughs> In a sema, we to ritembea kuringana na ukawaida ulimwengu. In English, it says according, according to the course of this world, Kuringana, I love in a sermon, according, how Kuringana, according to the prince of the power of the air. No, ladies, let me tell you, me, me, I, I, I fight demonic powers. And I know Satan exists. And I know curses exist. And I know it's very easy, Mustana, Kuzuidua Aoe, our Fanikiwa. These things exist. They exist. In fact, if you know it, Uja Tuombe, now we're serious. There are things we can do. You know, there's a likelihood your family, Awewe Mwenyewe, Kunamambo Ambao Mutu Pata Kwa family, Awewe Mwenyewe. Your mother Ali Kuza and he placed you under a system. Awewe mwenyewe katika maisha yako uliishi kuringana na ukawaida wa ulimwengu which has two areas na kuringana na mfaume wa uweza wa anga. Those two things are very interesting. Anybody ambao Unaka kuringana na ukawaida wa ulimwengu. The Bible says you are also under the prince of the powers of the air. Why am I saying so? There are things happening to, to sisters in the church. And because you are so sensitive to feelings and youth, 
Hamuna either the dynamics of the spirit world. You don't know how to start. Let me example. I was thinking came out the estate. Because it's closer, Nikona Kujapa Satisa. And I'll pray on my knees for three hours up to Sakumina Bili. My morning glory, Nikua Kwamagoti Kwanzia Satisa, Paka Sakumina Bili. Sometimes I like staying more. Uh, I don't know. I don't know how you pray. Mami masa mawili mimi anitoshi nasikia katika kama ni mchezo. When I stay longer, I can stay for five hours and I'm paka nitosheke. And I could and and, and I remember one time nilikuja hapa na I was through with the prayer na nikitoka I met four girls. Wabia bishop, can you go back please? We need anointing and deliverance. Why? Wakasema we know and it's so clear in our family there is a curse ya kuzuia marriage na the more tunaishi the more fears it is becoming kabia how mama yetu aliolewa akatupwa aunt yetu ni single mother we our parents our relatives have been forced to be single mothers na wakasema na sisi tuko watoto wane and we sense it is coming. Ule ako better ni that 80 years around there. Mwingine ako that 5. Mwingine rabda ako that 3. Mwingine 28. Asama, Bishop, this arrangement is enough to show you there's a problem. Kama ule mdogo ako 28 haja olewa. Na wale wagina wako ju that 3, that 5, that 8. We cannot wait any longer. That is a bad sign. Bishop, pray for us. I anointed them. Can I tell you something? From that moment, Arusi Tulizofanya next. Nizao. Every year, every year. Nimoja tu alifanya pefa. The following year, Tulifanya. Tukafanya. Tukafanya. Nwabia kitu ingine? They are all blessed. Kuna wasiku moja nilifugua biashara zao wote wane in the city. Nikaanza, you know, they, they, it's as if when I broke the curse, na wakaolewa wanafuatana, the spirit wanabalikiwa wanafuatana. Can I ask something? Kama hatu geomba, tuseme ni hali ya kawaida. You know you assume things. While demons, zimawafunga. So many sisters are at the demonic powers. Lakini kwa sababu wewe ni kasichana tu kamulembo, Demons, ne, demons as in a uruma? No. Actually, kama mmejua ba, the way demonic powers operate, oh, they are bad. I prayed for a satanist in this church. Alikuwa mekuja, alisema mekuja kuni attack a new way. Kusababu, hawakuwa wana attacka. Wana, they never believed I would nita, nita launch 10,000 sita. As a bishop, we wanted to kill you before that time. By some of the accident, they could not get me. At the Nikishika Maikivi, and I said, This man should be dead now. Now, I didn't need So, what she did, I could have pale. Niki anoint to Watu, I could have a I could have a Kushika Shimiaki and Kate Hapa. But Akishika in Anguka. To Rikutan Kamakaria Kakachin, Kabiana Amuka, Akaguka, Tena Amka. She said, Akasema hivi, Bishop, mimi ni natumia vitu bili. One, nikiagadia wasichana na wavrana hivi, ni na waweka roho ya usharati. Na akasema ni ombe. The first person ni diweka is my own daughter. You, know how, you see how demons operate? Her own daughter. Ako high school ni msharati. Akitoka shure, she cleaves her men. I, unakuta, unakuta nazara na manaume Kuna moja likuwa na hiyo It be the, it's funny Na ye mwenyewe Hello, praise God Na kuambia kama kuna wakati kulikuwa na vita Hata wazewa lika akando Ah Iyo diyo vita Iyo diyo, those are things we should allow us to do Cast out demons, destroy strongholds Otherwise Kuna mambo inawapata nye wadada. And you are just good sisters. But you are not covered. There are things you did. 
ambao ziliharibu network we the, the way you say safaricom network there's what we call image of god network na kuna mahali hiyo sura itoka and and ukiwa hapa your sexuality your mind whatever god made should have network with that where the image of god came from and that one inakuweka kwa program whereby you never miss your season but the moment unakuta on the way masturbation urana mwanaume network ilisha and then unagojea mungu that way you are waiting for god that way don't be deceived you need na shida ni kwamba most people don't repent ati you must have it and you fuse god no, no you, most of you don't repent you broke your virginity do you know what you do you just forget it unajua kuna kuokoka na kuna kutubu ulipookoka actually you came to christ sawa sawa but god has never had you repent and that's why what i would like us to do every girl in this church should restore network unajua network ipotea and you are driving yourself oh imeru imerudi imerudi there is a way na msidanganyike that thing is real bwana aswe sana kama sawa wasichana when we prayed it's like restoring network where kwa watu nyumbani tumeweka zuku safari common waliwaita nikawafukusha there are people who missed i had to call technicians for five days kazama let me go back to zuku kitabo baba yako taangalia unja kwetu wanaweka you know kwetu kuna uchokozi wa network wanaleta mpaka kwa nyumba hapo na baba can you please safari come wana eh mko wakali aggressive eh tuliwekewa ya razima in case you want to just drop na zuku kikiki kwa kwa nyumba yako drop ah sasa sasa najivunia kupembelezwa but if you don't mind you make a premium premium uh, sababu some of the neighbors ni wakubwa wa jeshi ma ceo some mps and some do a lot of work kwa nyumba now my wife appeared kutumia uh, pesa yake kwa mambo ya whatever so simu ikifika tu kwa gate sina sense mambo ile zuko eh inaanza kusema you know message has come to 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 no no nataka ukaribie zuko yako and network be restored unakuta kai we kama umeka away from network for two years hello sio ni kasimu yako eh sija kuna kwa eh umeka eh nitakurudishia au nikupatie ngine mpya rajao au au huwa ananichokosa saa zingine na Mungu na hello praise god mkato pereka hawa tu outing maridhini wapeleka tuwapeleka hawa wote watakula sana thank you simu simu yaweza kuwa menyamaza the moment kama kwetu sasa nikifika tu kwa sababu nina password hata siweke nikifika tu hata hapa kwa ofisi nikifika tu kama nimekaa bila ku, kuiangalia like unikenda america nikifika tu kwa bill sugar chiwa niko na niko na password yake message zinakuja wa 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 unakuta ulipokuwa doha eh hey, mama zina kula nyingi mimi nataka mkaribie network kuna network yenu kuna things that to start coming haya guy kuna pesa ulitumiwa 2 years ago na hukujua there's a decision that god made about you last month hukujua because you had no network amen kuna brother alikusalimia tu akasema dada god bless you nakambia mimi na, naomba ukamfanya ukamwambia eh oba sana madharau one wakati network rirudi 
huyu dear brother alikuwa kuoyo sasa sasa uwezi mu approach brother nimegundua ni wewe you know network when network comes haleluya bwana asifiwe imerudi oh i was supposed to do engineering nikafanya education i lost network when you have no network hello praise god there are so many things unafanya away from what god is in mind of god na unagudua kwamba every year every nyinyi kosa si unaona kosa kila wakati eh ukiwa na credits na vitu nakujaga nyingi sana maisha yako ni kama whatsapp kwamba hello please god wakati uko na mobile data is on things are ka? coming bishop akihubiri inakuja i think you need to have a mobile data whereby when they decide something there it just reflect in your heart i sense god want me to get married haya kama mjui hiyo network ni tofauti na kutamani mwanaume hao si tu tu ude yako na tu ude there's a lady ni mwambia dada i'll tell you when you get married kabisha ikamwambia nikamwambia nipe homework i'll tell you one day tukapatana kwa hapa kwa gate nikamwambia sister i see the glory of god on your face the glory for wedding and this week what no happened the following day duke jodu alikuja and had a what of wedding hello praise god kuna mmoja niliombea alikuwa na adugu muoe there was issues and i prayed a lot god told me muambie atakaposahau ule dugu amuondoe kabisa i will speak nikamwombea bwana kaniambia kwa nini kwa nini huyu dada the other late brother aliodolewa god spoke to me sasa hiyo siga mwambia hiyo hata sija mwambia mtu it's so painful as the brother died so i prayed a lot god told me why why those things happened hiyo hiyo siga mwambia even today i can't tell anybody even my wife is kwa mama mungu anasema na this one is just for god na mimi anijue and god told me anaenda kupatia udada a brother ambaye watabarikiwa zaidi na nikaambia the moment ataacha kukumbuka yule that day the god said i'll come do you know the moment alianza kuliaria niambia yes now you're not crying is over this week god you provide you with the one amekuchagulia now that couple is prospered they can move all over the world might prospered hakuna mtu ambaye binguni ale praise god mahali you, the image of god yako ilitoka that's where your network has headquarter na let me tell you hakuna msichana ambaye hatakiwi wakati fulani uolewe wakati fulani uwe uwe tajiri wakati fulani uzee watoto hata ukitaka kuita mmoja bishop katimo nitakuruhusu ukita bishop nikaita ya itakatimo bishop kwani kuna madhara gani kuna watu wengine unakuta mama yako baba yako alikwambia usimuite jina yake haikwambia hivyo yeye nimekupa yangu yangu haina madhara ukiza tu dugu twigi umaliza wadugu wa kwenu sio tuongeza yangu hapo ndio kwa sababu tu hawa dugu wane ndio mama yako alikuwa na mapacha maybe you could have having that blessing ya mapacha wawili wa kwanza wane sasa please the lord i'm i'm speaking something i want to do as you as ladies i would like you to do this badala ya kugojea mungu na una network why don't you repent because utagudua there are things you should repent mengine it involves your parents 
Because sometimes parents, they set a pattern. Let me, let me something. Utapata your mother aliolewa akatupwa. Au your mother kuna mtu, some of our parents akikuza hakuwa ameamua kukuza. Ni mtu tu walikutana pale wakapedana. That's why I sympathize with the women. Somebody just aliweka bego hapo na akasahau na akaenda hata akaenda akaweka kuingine. Eh? Like the parable of the sour. Hmm? And then your mother got pregnant. You know pregnancy is serious. Na mtu kupenetrate ya unga na weke bego is something kama mchezo tu. Mchezo tu ni kama ameenda haja. But pregnancy is serious. Sex is not serious. Hasa upada wanaume. Some of them are very bad. But pregnancy, bego kuingia, ibaki. Do you know when you do sex, mwenye anakuwa affected sana and na mwenye anapata impartation kama ni kasa whatever is a woman because ni katika wewe bego zinaachwa. Na hazitoki. Kinawa huku. And that thing carry a lot of things. Feelings. Limitation. You become one body na mwenye adira na wewe. Especially anybody who penetrated your body. Now, hello, praise God. Do you know in that circumstance your mother kakuza? How dad alifanya sex na yeye haku ataka mtoto. And when your mother got pregnant walitusiana sana na baba yako. Kwani yomeza? Now, those things how is Jewish? You don't know them. So nikweli, you don't know them. But they attract a spirit. Rafrani. One thing I've come to discover, those patterns, the Kijuda, they follow children. They follow children. Hello, praise God. They need to be destroyed. You can't just live that way. They need to be destroyed. Aya. Other things about to me honor in our families is witchcraft, nascasis, ambazo unakuta familia yenu mama yako kuambia kwamba na kuna watu wetu ambao watupendi na kuna watu wetu ambao natutusi can you destroy any friends around your family because there are patterns forming around families unakuta babu uh, your grandmother aliteswa hivi your mother akateswa hivyo no create that pattern it is following all people even your your elder sister don't assume. Haya, misi wafichi, utazeeka, weza zeeka, kwa maana mungu hata gojea. Ears cannot wait for you. Seasons cannot wait for you. Kama hutarekebisha mambo mapema, utazeeka hivo. I, I, I don't know, but I must speak this. That most girls have lost network with where our images your image as a plan is it God? But sometimes you, you realize there's something wrong. If you ever did sex, let me say something. Some of the people, I don't know what surrounds immorality, fornication. I wish Nikepon Nafas ya kuandika Ninini Utedeka Wakati Mwana Ume Ambaye Simu Mewako. Anavuja your virginity. Oh, no, no, no. I wish I could write what I know, the revelation. Because breaking that thing, Nasimo Mawako, that thing, order, the order that God has for you is interfered with. Hello, praise God. And it's important to pray. Naujitakase. Mambo matatu. Inherited patterns. Inherited patterns. The family. Inherited patterns. Unakuta. Kuna pattern. Ikona. Yani mambo imejipanga hivi. Mpaka ina effect. Break it. Break it. Jabra pili. Is. Hello praise God. But you are acquired. You are acquired like a curse. 
uli uli we mwenyewe kupitia kwa tabia zako kuna pigo ulialika badara ya Mungu akuhurumie badara ya Mungu akurehemu kuna kitu ulifanya ambacho hakivuti rehema za Mungu it never attracts the masses of God and as long as umekata kutubu unajifanya unajipiga kifua God will never never bow to you Mungu haina mimi mtu Kwa sikiza kama umekaa hivi kama umemeza taribo hivi Mungu naye amesema hata kuinamia kama hutainama wabie God I submit your will forgive me God we are about to you so utakuta kwamba eh hizi hizi miaka yenu ya nguvu unakuwa unakuta uko stable na little bit only to discover ukifika miaka ya 50s you are being defeated kwa sababu ya mambo ambao ugerekebisha do you know kuna ujasiri hutajipa there's boldness that you cannot create in you it has to be given by the holy spirit so may the Lord help us in that issue. Bwana asifiwe. Let me say this. I like us uh, one thing uh, that I know ni kwamba the will of God exists. Bible says in Jeremiah 29 verse 11, I know the plans I have for for you. Katika sura ya Mungu, what's the plan that God has for, for us? One is for your well-being. God says, those plans are not bad. They are not for evil. So, this is for your well-being. Number two, mipango ya mungu si ya kuumiza. It's not harmful. And number three, the plan of God is to give you hope. And number four, the plan of God is to give you a sense of destiny. Is that clear? Mapenzi ya Mungu ni kwa wema wako. You become better. God desires that you become better. Mapenzi ya Mungu si ya kukuumiza. Mapenzi ya Mungu ni ya kukupatia hope. Na mapenzi ya Mungu ni kukufanya uwe na sense of destiny kwamba you are uko na sense ya future. Now, ukiagalia iyo, iyo Jeremiah 29 verse 11, verse 12 says, Then you will call upon me, and you will go and pray to me, and I will reason to you, and you will seek me and fight me when you search for me with all your heart. Aya, Jeremiah 29 verse 11 says, I know the plans I have for you. Sasawa, they are good not to harm you, to give you a sense of destiny. Now, ukieda tuerof in Erezea, how will that happen? That's now when God says, for that plan to happen, God says, you will call upon me. Number two, and you will go. Number three, and pray to me. I will listen to you. And you will seek me and find me when you search for me with all your heart. Let us discover this thing. Wakati Yesu, one of the things ambao uh, ni amana sana kwa vijana ni the will of God. Now, wakati mungu anasema kwamba ana a good plan for you. Haya, how do you open it? Ukiagaria Yesu akiongea, aliongea mama tatu ya maana sana. Akasema, ask, it shall be given. Number two, seek, and you shall. Number three, knock, and the door shall be opened. There are three things ambazo buwana agetaka ufanye. To open, to open his will. 
to open his will. One is asking. The other is seeking. The other is knocking. I wish I can teach that. Kuna tabia inao itwa omba. Kuna wakati mingine si kuopo ta omba. Although it will be still like prayer. Tafuta. Kuna wakati mingine siyo kutafuta ni kubisha. Now, normally, inakwaka hivi. Kuomba, asking, diyo inakua ya kwanza. Ukifauru katika kuomba, God you raise you katika another advanced level of prayer inaitua seeking. Seeking. If you seek and seek and seek, God will raise you to another level of prayer in it or knocking. Now, asking is far, a little bit far. Baba naomba unipe. Ukienda dani kidogo, God tell you, seek and you shall find. Haya, katika seeking, what do you find? You may not find what you really want, but you may find the way to what you want. You may find the door to what you want. I sought after it, Bwana ka confirm jiani hii. And God confirmed the entrance. Then you go to the entrance. When you are at the entrance, you know this is the door to what I want. You knock until the door is open. When the door is open, you enter. You don't, you don't struggle again. Unaingia and you become. Now, the three faces has meaning. Hallelujah. Amen. Let's talk about the 10,000 seater. You know, I talked about that thing 10 years ago. God blotted to me. Even more. You kill God. Let, let me let me teach you. Si uko na roho Mungu. Si uko na roho Mungu. Uko na roho Mungu. Kuna ule akona roho roho ya ule mwingine au roho yako. There are people hana roho Mungu, hana shetani lakini akona yake tuweke yake. Those are spirit uko na yako. Roho wa Mungu make you more god conscious. Roho yako. Eh? It makes you more conscious about yourself. There are three areas of consciousness. God consciousness. You are outside. Huku inje. Consciousness. Na kuna consciousness yako. Kujihisi. Kuhisi mungu. Au kuhisi dunia. Haya. Nataka msikize. Nayo nita wabea. Nayo nita wawuda kidoa. Naunga tu prepore. Unajua leo staki ku. Kukemea mtu. Oh, ni mekemea. Ni mekemea kidogo. Ni pokea kuzu hita kakitu. Ni mekemea kidogo. Let me tell you what will happen. I want to pray for you right now that God restore network with where your image came from. I will tell you what will happen. Ni wabie. Mi na waona. Tusi mi ni pasa u na waona. Na ujue tafanyika. From today, utaanza kitu kinaitua consciousness. Ya what God wants. Because I have prayed for you. Na kile mungu wa meniambia ni kwamba. You are detached. So you are mind. Haijui. Utaolewa au huolewi. Utakuwa si. Si tuwagea ukweli. Si mnakuwa kaifu sometime. Mwasi jifanya. Where joy, but the guy with two. One of the problems with girls, youth, ni kwa ba ukomia kaya guvu. Kama farasi ire jamori park. But now, where do you take the strength? Unakuta kwamba kitu kimoja katika akiri. How do we? How do we? Now is the devil who does that? So that, ukose kujua, so that most girls, 
utakapokuwa umeolewa katika akili yako kuna gap Let me give example a brother in this church zamani alioa akaambia dada Mungu ameniongoza kwako ni kuoe and they confirmed now that sister was employed in a pharmacy she was actually the manager so mwenye pharmacy depended so much on that sister so wageenda kwa wageenda kuleta mandawa so wafanyi kazi kwa ile pharmacy nafikiri kuna kijana mmoja alikuwa anamtaka na dada akakata akakata sababu ame kijana anaja kuokoka si unakuta vile mnachokosa kwa mtu anataka hiyo kitu na hii nyingine ukikataa na kuonea wivu eh unajua dada mtu akitaka kuharibu kwa 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 you know mtu ana ana ku frustrate dio we weak dio mwishoe you give in so they do that hasa wakupa kazini eh sasa sasa udada alionoa wivu somebody made sure ataribu hiyo kwanza aribu engagement kukatokea uvumi kwamba udada hulala nje na boss ate huwa wakienda Nairobi wanapatikana kwa hoteli wakifanya A na B na pia kuna Z tafikiri anaona gani na kuna ndugu ali, ali, ali. they made sure huyu brother anamuoa amesikia na walimharibu do not the brother said god kwa maana ulininenea kama uliona vyema nioe kahaba nitamuoa i can't change that voice if god you spoke to me and you knew ni kahaba nitamuoa kwa hivyo this this is that consciousness this if you become conscious network yako na kiti cha enzi where you are in, the image of god came from there are things that be so clear and that clarity will dominate our other issues amen haya wacha we adu tudifanya na ni mimi nishikanisha na nikawekelea mikono sana si miguu mikono wacha dada azae mtoto akawa brown ni brown iragi ni gani munisaidie ni white au ni brown au ni you know in south africa wako na black colored and white i don't know why was going to say white they are not white those people they, they, i think they are red <laughs> do you see twito black you know some some of these term, terminology black americans white americans colored ah, anyway wacha yesu arudi i tell you i don't know kama kuna watu tulikosana na wazungu wa South Africa ukienda cho lazima cho iosho na chemicals because you are black mimi niende aoshe ataenda ako Kenya hapana ataenda kwao hi hi anyway mbarikiwe now why we pata mtoto do you know they made an effort kwenda mpaka mahali hiyo nyumba hao watu wanafkaa na wanaongea kwa corridor asema kayaye walizam mtoto brown na tuliambia huyu mwanaume kwamba wanaraga na bus bus hiyo ni ragi ya bus kabisa akasema angalia brother ni black dada ni black brown umetoka wapi <laughs> tena kukachafuka and the brother said no way I don't think the network can go away. Do you know finally what they are and they are doing well? Do you know why? Katikati ya akili ya brother na where the image of God came from there was a clear communication that no one again do. Do you know sasa kama Do you know new sisters unakuta mwenye amekuoa ni alikuja akwambia nataka kuoa 
ukafikiria kidogo 1 plus 1 minus 1 plus 2 kana dogo si mbaya kuna kitu hapa huna akili ya mtu kuna kitu Mungu akoweka that causes you to break through with his throne that brother ukikana yeye kuna kitu ujui na unakuta ukikana yeye huwa unamsoma umeweka your expectations baada yake hivi ukiona hakai hivi hakai hivi hakai hivi hakai hivi na already umeapa na yeye unaona kama si yeye na already uko kwa doa na umeza watoto wawili imebaki bishop katimu azaliwe unakuta si huku na shida hapa unaona and that's why siku hizi young couples siku hizi we have a lot of problem young couples makis ambao ni kona ya young couples imenisubua m mm. mtu anakuambia dugu hajaenda nje dada hajaenda nje na mtu anakuambia hivi bishop <laughs> kama dada moja aliabiwa dugu aba amekuoa kabla haja kuoa alikuwa rafiki na mama fulani ni mtu aliyule hiyo story haikuweko akapiwa akapiwa the issue is kama wewe ndiye uliapa na dugu na akakuoa how comes you still need other people to tell you who your husband is si una kuna mali kuna mali kuna network do you know leo ukitaka kuharibu marriage ya mtu so is young couples just to, 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 to tell the brother mwenye ameoa ni wewe ujui alikuwa ametoa mimba ine ah. no ukitaka unione siku hizi is very easy to victim kuuda kitu na si, unajua hivyo na mwenye kusema ni mtu ambaye unajaribu kukana unashidwa some of these are women ambao unaweza trust kama mama at, kama your mentor na akuingize mpaka unagojea dugu aingie jioni kama namgojea na mishale kama ile ya Roman soldiers mm ataninjua uh, diamond wayo wewe umeharibika mimi najua kesi moja na ingine na ingine nimejaribu kurekebisha mnisubua na kile kinasemwa i was there ni kitu kimeundwa onda ata hii mwito mimi nimeba kuna kuna somebody who told me bishop can i see you yes akaza kulia why why are you crying kabia bishop i don't know i don't know it's like dying why kwa sababu niliunda uongo uongo eh what kind of lie nilitafuta uongo that can destroy you and destroy your ministry paka nikashidwa ananiuliza nini sasa huyu is a young girl atatujuani sana na akasema alijaribu kuogea hata kwa pastors nikamwambia ndio nisichafuke don't tell me and may god help me never to know it but i forgive you hello kama sina network ya uhakika if kama mimi na mungu aliyeniita hatujuani vizuri si is very sick mtu kuharibika yes kuna mwanamke alikuja kwetu nyumbani <laughs> mimi hata sijui mimi asimjui nilikuwa namuona huku huku kube ni satanist die aliharibu kanisa moja hapa kubwa sana hapa akajaribu kuharibu gospel outreach yeye huwa anakuta muke wa pasta amwambia why Nina waka roia. Kama wali ambia mka wangu, mimi ni Mungu tamenisha idea. Tulikuwa kwa kitanda. Alito kai. Nini hata simjui? Unajua pastor alitoa nguo, mimi ndio nikataa kutoa kai. <laughs> Mungu akusaidie mama. Uh, ai ai, dada jaja. Mke wangu akamwambia, "Now I have an issue with you man, mama." Bishop amehubiri America na ni zamani nilikuwa nimeenda Britain and I know so many beautiful girls rich women rich warembo wengine walimtamani 
Me, I know my wife. Kuna wa mama wa membabia openly. Tukiubiri. Kwa ba, mama sikufichi. Mume wako ni memuinda ni kashidwa. Kwa ingina ata kutoka ngambo. My wife, anajua. I hate morality. Tuketwa na wewe, anashida. Ukimuambio, atikuwa na kupeda, ata kushekerea. Sasa, uu mama, akabio mama, madam, kuna kitu ambao sichiki. Wale wasichana na wamama, you know, I have had good millionaires. Women with money. Oh, 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 oh. Ambaye ni walembo na kama ulepa utoshi wanaunda ingine. All about the world, what happened? It'll be here, loving to kill up a hali. Sasa, praise the Lord. Buwana asifiwe. Tumeenda nae huduma hata Amerika. She knows how to behave. Na watu muambia. Sasa ni muambia hivi. Mama, kuna kito nisubua. Kama bishop, haku jaribua na hawa walebo wote. I can't understand. Vida na jaribua na mama kama wewe. The way you are. Ah, pana. Gai. The way you are. Ata wewe na mjaribu, hakuna. Ata, alimabia ata hapa, ata sitaji kuoba. Dhureno. That's the last time we show her. Alienda kawa west. Haka inga the church. She did that to pass as wife. Kanisa ya watu miya tatu ilisha within a week or two. Kasa moja likuwa hapa, I will not tell you the pastor, likuwa hapa. A big church, you have to come out for Billy. Ali Marisa, she goes that way. Hello, praise God. Ni ambieni. Atukuzo Yesu. Nini? Brother anakuwa, ame kuadimaya. Joy, anakuadimaya kasi anakafupi hivi kana soma. Anadimaya ile kitu. Anapedaka hiyo kai. Lakini katika kuna sehemu ya akili that should clear with you. It can only be cleared by God who made you. Sasa wano na mukika, muna subwana, muna subwana, muna subwana sana. Kitu kitoko tu, anakutesa. Muna subwana. Hello, praise God. Jude, aki kuona kazini, muko na another manager, anasema angali, kwa sababu, hakujui katika utakatifu. You know you need to be clear. Anakuona tu vio litoa nguo, na ikama yukitu, anakukataa mwezi bili. Sama wacha ikuwaza itakaswe. Paka nafuka wiki moja, sama mbukai, sida wakika kiosha yu kitu. You see, there's a lot of complicated things. Kuna tukwe mwingi, ungea tu yachana crusade. Crusade. Saa tatu. Kuwe kwa nyo ambia, oh, di umefika. Si bada disa saa saba. Hata ujiku na crusade. Anambua saa sabi nanjua. Vye na kuona. Umepitia pahali wewe. Si ule mama. Dugu wa nasikia. Dugu wa yabia bishop. I feel like I can suffer depression. My wife is possessed. Now. I want to tell you this thing by the grace of God. The Lord wants to restore Haliako Yakushika Network Nakitcha Enzi. Whereby, I don't know, I don't know, your life. Kuna mahali huwa. You know katika mafudisha you are taught to be it's you, your life, your dressing, whatever. Whoever says that, Edo Wagaria, England, they have the highest level of divorce. They have the highest level of divorce. Because you, kuna maumagina mbao, what I know, the Lord 
will connect you with his mind. Na Mungu aliyosema uundwe in his image. The image of God in you. The image of God in you. We will have connection with God. Kwamba from today, from today, any step of your life will be very clear. Can I say something? Do you know you can't tell when you, get, when you are getting married? Not from the age, not from whatever, but you sense, you sense the maker of your soul, the God of heaven is bringing that to your heart and your mind. Naikusubui? Naikusubui? Sio tamana, sio meaka. Na sio anything but iyo kitu kifiko. And you can sense it. Naitaka, unaolewa. Praise God. Buwana suwa sana. Another thing very important ni ambao tugetaka ifatika kwenu is career progress. Career progress. Career progress ni hivi katika maisha kuna wakati unafika unashika taranta yako hivi. If you hold your talent your talent moves very fast. Vita moja tuko nao ni kwamba do you know talent makes you happy? Talent it matches with your ability and the way your mind is. Do you know your mind is made in a way there's a talent you can handle and you move very fast. Mimi mimi ama preacher. Waga mimi ama preacher. Ukiniambia nifuruge hii 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 waislamu hapa nifuruge watu na injili. Muniambia bishop wacha bishop u bishop kwaza ingia isiri. Ha wa 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 wa. I do it. Uhu utashindwa kama ni waislamu wanainama <laughs> you know i went to a meeting kulikuwa na waislamu 300 mwenye alikuwa mkubwa hiyo area mkristo na aliandika do you know those muslim did all what I, all what walifanya tu kile tuli agree and i tell you you know god just moves in his own way i'm saying this by god's grace Kariya yako you are real career. Ukishika tu hivi. Kuna kitu utokea in your soul, in your mind, in your body and you make progress very quickly. Yaani hiyo kitu kama ni biashara, marketing, nini? Yaani ile hata even the goods you sell. Nobody has a resist. I remember one day we shared with the brother akona magari 700 kodi mestuka gari moja 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 tulikotana london yeye alikuwa na birmingham kununua magari ingine kabia bishop kama kuna kitu alifurahia ni wakati alishika talanta yake he moved very fast Within three years, unakuta mtu ako na utajiri wa billions. Another brother rafiki yangu, ayambia bishop, nimeuza prozago mbili tatu, nikajeka nyumba ya floor nane. Haina loan. Akaona kuna plot next. Akachukua loan na hiyo nyumba, akajenga ingine ya floor saba. Haya, akafikiri ya pili haina loan akachukua loan hiyo within five years akona nyumba kama hizo nane he is moving very fast management yake is so high kwamba five years hivi kuna nyumba kama mbili amelipa already hello praise god juzi anataka kuniuzia moja iko na room 176 na kila room ni 10000 shillings lakini alikuwa nataka nipatie plot yangu bahari abo is even more prime than that nikajua hapa kuna kanyaga break kidogo 
na hiyo ni dogo zingine zake za kwa room 300 room 400 room mia. every room 10000 or 15000 primary man coming alikanyanga taranta yake nitaombea pia leo mtoke kwa confusion kanyanga taranta ya mm. make a lot of money mimi si okay mambo about wewe nyinyi kama nyinyi mimi kama kukasi juu kwa wengine wenu what i'm talking is what i know nyinyi amjui what i'm talking nyinyi amjui hiyo ni yale mambo nimeona it works whenever let me tell something mtu akiingia kwa kile kitu mungu alikuingia you need move fast eh na hiyo kitu ukikifanya You, re, you rejoice so much. Hallelujah. Mimi tukitoka kwa barabara mkiona nyinyi mkiona walevi mnasubuka. I tell you, mimi naona soko. Ah, walevi kuja na siwagopi. Kuna mmoja alitoa buduki, kaja bishop. Hii ndio natumia. Ndio hii mahubiri ni ajabu. Na siwagopi? Anatakaje? Hii ndio natumia, nimetoka Kithunguri. Nakuja town na pika mtu risasi na nyanganya gari na uza na kana kula na Niambie bishop nitakaje bila hii. Wewe ukiona hiyo sio tajiko jolea. Kwa hiyo sio issue. Naambia I will teach you. Na naokoka, you know those things. That's my calling. When I'm doing it, I really rejoice and I do it very fast. Amen. To the right Sunday. And I uh, your crusade sadi kokaokoka watu zaidi ya 500 to me i like that Ooh, when i see them ah don yaraka the problem kwa basa sasa wamezidi wa capacity ya kanisa la githorai that's how ukishika your talent pesa taingia that's how Okay, I, na mimi si wafichi na leo nitawaombea that one mimi sitaki kukaa na nyinyi kama hamna pesa hivi ai na hamna ai ya 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 kai you know you look good i can imagine dada kama huyu muongeze tu akae na Yesu na akae mzuri can you can you can you imagine how you can manage nyumba ya bedroom kumi nice place ah ya 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 what pen do you live well Amen. Unakuta una nyumba kama hii compound ni yako kuna parking. Tukiingia tunaingia kitchen uko na fridge hapo, uko na microwave, uko na sijui nini. We you haogopi. Hata Magreti Kenyatta kiingia, umogopi you have started way of living. Unatuambia mkitaka kulala hapa hapa mko nyumbani. Yaani you feel good. Life should be good. Na labda let me let me tell you. If you don't pray and break yokes the pattern ambao umepata kwa your parents have you ever seen this way hello praise god the other day i prayed for a family kwao hakuna mtu anamaingi university na wawili waliojaribu kuingia waliharibika vichwa kuingia tu hivi breaking kuingia tu i said i want to unlock There are things kama mjui wewe sio Adam Adam ndiye alikuwa wa kwanza wewe umezaliwa na watu wengine ni walevi wengine sijui ni wakorofi na hiyo wewe begu ya baba yako ilibeba vitu nyingi sana it's true our parents environment about we are brought it we need to be pure na mimi nataka sasa staki mambo ya kurithi kutoka kwa wazazi hiyo damu I want to be connected with the center of my image. Mahali nilitoka, mwenye alisema na tuumbe. Mwenye aliambia Jeremiah, I knew you before I formed you in mother's womb. I want to know him who knew me and I want to be connected with what he knew. Na mwe very serious. My sister, unless you claim that, things are difficult. God I want to be connected with what you knew about me. Let's claim it. And you move very fast. Hello praise God. You know you could have be having a demon now you. 
kuna mtu mmoja inawachacha alisema niko na unabii sema Mungu ameniambia mzee Jomo Kenyatta hajui kutawara Kenya guys na yakobia haleluya roho mtakatifu do you know aliyeda mpaka state house akaulizwa wewe ni wa wapi kiabu kiabu eda kwa provincial commission wa central province nyeri wewe ni wa wapi kiabu eda kwa dc wa kiabu wewe ni wa wapi kiaba eda kwa dio wa kiaba wewe ni wa wapi kawagwari sio wapi eda kwa shifu ai tukagudua hilo si mzuri akaba katika jina la yesu wewe roho baya literally kulisika sauti kusema kwa hewa nimejulikana nimejulikana a demon speaking is there is a mtu kwa na pepo na hujui and appeared normal na ni kweli kenyata alikuwa tawali mzuri alikuwa amenyonga mtu sijui sijui ni ni wakati kulikuwa na maafa mengine sijui kama ni yeye lakini i don't know but there were issues za what za detainer ni mambo kama hayo bwana yesu asiwe sana career progress you need a career progress nataka kus, nataka kwe nataka kuona mnaenda speed sana bwana nataka kuona wangaye nataka kuona mnaenda speed sana speed ha, sana mimi sina shaka i know it's very easy mtu kwenda bali jambo lingine ambao nikataka tuwe naye is the witness of the holy spirit the witness of the holy spirit atakwenda wapi hii manyumba ya bahati hamjegewi ni mwenye nyumba nini ni nyumba nyumba hii hii ah uongo wa bahati nani anaandika tisema eh hiyo hiyo ni uongo bahati kuna uongo mwingi sana na mtu sina shida shida ina hiyo mmeandikwa mara ya kwanza si mliandikwa tena mkaandikwa na nms na mevujwa mkaandikwa na sonko mkaandikwa na kidero ndio kaande kuregeuka i know tunaombea watu wa bahati kuna wana anyway no na uwe na na upate baraka eh na matunda upate tena ulete naona iko mzuri barikiwa sana witness of the spirit kuna kitu katika mwana youth as you grow inaitwa ushahidi wa holy spirit now uki ukiongozwa na roho wa Mungu kuna sauti ya ndani inaitwa ushahidi wa roho wa Bwana I don't know how to teach this because we don't have much time. Youth, you don't have to kusubuka sana na sauti ya Mungu. Kuna wakati Roho Mtakatifu in your heart ana confirm jabo. Na unasikia kabisa ni yeye. We need to restore that. Roho Mtakatifu anashuhudia with your heart. Jabo fulani ambao Mungu amekuwekea jambo lingine la maana sana we need to restore in sisters ni kuondoa strongholds mpaka maisha ya kila msichana is flowing we need to have life that is flowing jambo lingine wa dada ni mtu kuigikuwa katika mazingira where the holy spirit truly can operate now exposure ingine tuko nao ya wasichana inatusubua sana and i want to say this to you friends by the grace of god nataka kuwa na muda wa kuombea wale wamefuko shure Bwana ukiwa tu kwa university usiwe tu na degree let me say that say this kuna tofauti ya wisdom and knowledge degree unaofanya ni knowledge but ndani yako kuna kile Mungu anataka uwe so the degree should 
by itself it should by itself cannot provide money it may not provide career lakini mungu anaweka ndani yako kile amekuchagulia na hiyo degree facilitates like now what is wisdom wisdom is capacity to rule the world through your gifting tuseme hivi haya uko hapa unafanya computer whatever technology katika akili yako already unaona eh ukitoka hiyo training utaenda wapi na utafanya nini na utakuwa wapi are you understanding haya niangalie Sometimes what what do you people do unapata una degree unaenda kutafuta kazi So unanyimwa hapa unanyimwa hapa unaambia hakuna kazi hakuna kazi alafu mtu wa standard 8 ambaye amefungua kiosk pale kwa barabara anauza swahili dishes Watu wanatoka idea sio ya nakula kwake Is more wise than you hata nakuajiri Kucha ni kuajiri kwa sababu pesa Hello. You know kuna kijana anaitwa Kuria. Kuna mnamjua baba yake ndiye mwenye sunshine. Baba yake alifika salary 2. But he has the best hostels in Rift Valley. In the wisdom. I although Kuria over works. Watakiwa like now nikiwa hapa. Mimi mhubiri. Kutoka hapa bahati ni hubili. Mimi nikipewa wewe na wewe na wewe ni abob ni abob ni wabadilishe muwe vile mko nataka it does take it takes minutes i can tell you what you shall be what we shall do and if i say that it you become and you move very fast no igwa haya is true leo angali nikiomba nikuangalia niambia mungu speak to me i can tell you where god wants to recruit that's my gifting and What is wisdom? Wisdom is when you are able to locate your space. Degree does not tell you your space, it gives you knowledge. But you need Bwana akupe talanta na afanye hiyo degree unasoma already uone ni wapi itafanya kazi na vile atakupa pesa. Already the wisdom can speak about how your degree will be profitable and that's why tunashinda na graduates because when you kusoma ulisoma unabeba certificate utafute kazi wisdom wisdom haitafuti kazi wisdom creates kazi even before wajiriwe kuna ka kitu unafanya mimi nitawaombea Mungu akuweke hiyo kitu Usiniambie hakuna kazi, uniambie mimi na naona bishop niombe nitaanza kazi yangu Mombasa Road. Mimi nitaanza kitu kwa hii barabara. Hello, akili yangu inaona kariya fulani. Do you believe can, can you believe God for that? That's very very important by his grace it has to happen in Jesus Christ name. Amen. Jabu ringeni taombea means we have to pray kama umefika wakati wa kuolewa nothing should stop you olewe haraka and don't joke around with it if there's any impediment and what we shall do kama wewe kama msichana kuna mambo ulifanya na mwili wako you interfered with the image of god likeness of god tell god lord i admit i did this sin forgive me let's turn me back to network so that whatever umepaka kunihusu haitanipita are you hearing this ah yes lazima kuwe na kitu kinapitishwa now don't be defeated waje mimi ni mhubiri and at my stage sita kuficha if you don't understand them now two years to come utanitafuta bishop i wish i understood what you meant you meant praise the lord bwana asifiwe because sikuisi wasichana huaribika haraka 
but you are not supposed to allow it. I want to keep network with the source of the image of God in me throughout. Nanasema mungu majira yangu ikifika jabu frani. I don't miss it. In just Christ's name. Hallelujah. Jabu ringina mbao itakusaidia sana sana ni kuanza a pattern of spiritual exercises. Ni kuanza a pattern of prayer that keeps your gift awake. That keeps your heart awake. That keeps your mind clean. Kawaido kijiachilia usipo omba vizuri. Usipo omba vizuri. Utapata kwamba your sensitivity uwezo wako wakugudua the will of God unaharibika haraka. Mwanadamu anatama na uzito utoka nao na mwili. So, mutu wanza discipline. Mwanayuthi anatakua awe na discipline that keeps the fire burning, that keeps your heart awake, that keeps your mind with courage. Kwa ba hakuna mutu unawa, hawogopi. Hawogopi. Na pahara ambapo hakuna jia yako, you will create your way. Pahara ambapo hawasemi Yesu ni buwana, utasema mpaka kutoke fellowship. There is kind of fire that you maintain. Uneza panga, unasema ni kiamuka asubui, nitakuwa ni kiopa two hours. I'll be leading Bible three chapters a day and I make notes. And every week I'll be having two days fasting. And I know, there are things that you have that keeps the fire in your heart burning. Ili, wengine mukieda shure. Hausemi yesu wa mekuokoa. You add it up. You add up. Kwa mana hakuna pari ya kuna utawara. Either utawara wa watu, wa shetani na tamazao. Au wa yesu. Utaeno nakuta kwamba. You know, umenu university. How ni watu? You know, in hostel, they are doing all what they want. In a way that usipotokea clearly. It's very easy to jipate kwamba. Wewe mwenyewe. Eh, kuna mambo imejingiza dani yako and you are not right with God you have to keep the fire in a way that whenever I am I am covered niko na ujasiri and I can testify about Christ and his work in just Christ's name hallelujah and when you, when you are sensitive you don't miss your seasons you don't miss you never miss your season. Higher. Why, what, why am I saying that? Do you know my sister since you are sensitive in the spirit? Ata mungu ataona vya makunene. Kwa mana utasikia. If you are not sensitive, ata uwezo wakusikia mungu wakiongea huna. So why, 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 why do I, why do, why do, why, how can God speak to somebody? Amba, hana haja na sauti. Na hana haja, hana. Hana, hata kidogo. Na muzidaganyo na anybody. Hakuna mutu hapa ambaye mugu binguni haongei kukuhusu. Kuna wengine hapa, God is just looking for you to tell you who you are. To tell you where he's taking you. To tell you what he thinks about you. Na musia, and don't, don't fail to know kwamba wewe hau kutoka duniani ulitoka kwa mungu. Sometimes people want us to be so secular. Kwa hapa tukiongea mamba ya Holy Ghost. Unasema you don't need Holy Ghost in everything. Na mina waambia. Kani tulitoka wapi? Kwani tuliubo na nani? Kwani uhaiwe tulitoka wapi? We, know, we, we can't avoid being sensitive. So many businesses zimefunguka by the ways of God. Somebody came here the other day, very poor man. I prayed kamabia by authority of God. I release your breakthrough. I'm a rudy. Nabahasha, I'm a bishop. from your mom. I'm a bishop. I just want to tell you thank you. Nikamabia is a daka itapena kandisani. It's okay. Nikona a business that's doing very well. Hapa town. Kusama, Stuka Kamairo now, whatever. Bishop, you prayed for me two weeks ago. And God went away. Kama maombi haisaidi. Kwanini yombe huyu napate biyasaya maana hivu. 
Hello, praise God. <laughs> Wapendwa, kama hakuna kiroho, ni biashara, like now there's a brother, biashara yake ilipigwa ajabu. Akaja nikamwambia, nikamwambia, I want to train you on the promises of tithing in Marakai 3 verse 10. God says, nitafugua madrisha binguni mukose pahara pa receive those blessings. There are so many. How will you rebuke the devourer? Nikambia, nataka we claim this promise. Na nataka in your, in your business, you set it in a way you are able to identify tithe. Akalita Bishop, can I see you now? After a month, the business ime panuka ajabu. Walio muinukia, they cannot manage. Akalita Bishop, like now today, I've made a profit of four million. I mean, oh, brother, hey, Bishop, is happening. Tangu uniombe, na unifudishe the promises of tithing. Jameni kama kiroha isaidi. Siwa mesaidika. Because people want to tell us, ati mabata si kiroho, kama mabata si kiroho, si roha, ha, kama si kiroho, tuodwe roho yako. Si utakuwa maiti. Yes. So, so, let me say this. Sisi tumewahubiria. And we are also doing well by God's grace. Let me tell the truth. We know nyumba ya mugu ni kibirio. Of late, ni meanza kuona the other day an MP, member of parliament, I mean, if you are my bishop, I've seen you preaching. I need to walk with you. I need you to be my mentor. A very powerful MP in Kenya. Mwingida mekoja hapa tukakawa office for five hours. A very senior MP. Aminiona kwa YouTube, my bishop, Nataka uwe my spiritual father. How? Muna kachi na governor. Akabia, Bishop, I know you. And they always tell me, Bishop, we value your intelligence. We want you to be our spiritual father. Spiritual father. The other day, kuna muke moja wa governor. Alitafuta nabe ya muke wagu. Natsia na mbita usiku. Mama, we need you people. Jameni kama sisi ni kama hat. Si yao ni watu wabao wakona mabayao. Na nakuwabia bishop kanyupu. Kuna moja. Eh? Nyo ya nikabia si uko chini yangu. Ada my anointing yes. Alisimama na chama ya jubilee. Mahali ambapo kuingia. Ilibidi mtu haya unda. Ni unda. Neto unda. Hurubaru. Bishop, it's too much, it's too hard. Nikamambia, as long as you are under the anointing, norikujo kaniambia, I'm your spiritual father, I'm interceding for you. Do you know Ali Peter? Ali Peter. Kambia, Bishop, this is a miracle. Mimi ni MP, pali uda, a stronghold. Wakajali, kukawa na problem, Certificate yake na haitoki. Kuna forces. Akabia, Bishop, pray for me. Nikambia, I'm not even praying. Do this. Can you go back? I command them to give you. Aliludi ya kabuta after after. Wee, 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 diyo. Shika, shika, shika. Kama roho hatawali mambo. Mutaniambia ni wampi hatawali. Wewe ukiolewa. If your husband is hard working, anatoa tithe vizuri na ni mtu aliye na sound mind na ameokoka vizuri you'll be happy your husband akiwa hard working pesa ikiingia anachukua wastana wengine utakufa na heart na heart failure hard working ada woman eh walikuwa hapa kamkuji wanateseka the moment wamepata mali mzee amechukua kahaba asisa in the church somewhere kahaba na waka something interesting walienda kwa mchawi Tanzania ili muke wa kwanza akufe nili tulipo na kuwa bako wake I, I was surprised nikabia mama if that's what your husband has done I anoint this house I break those yokes mama yambia alipata haja kuenda kwa cho alitua makaa black chako for two hours I don't know what is that. 
ne mume wake sasa hiyo amekaa pahali kwa 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 kwa, kwa, ba, kwa pub eh? wanakalia viti na kahaba ule wanakunywa pombe kukatokea hadhi quick only viti zao bili wa shaking only those two chairs wakachekerewa kwa ba na wakikalia ingine inatingika until the man ran away akajua ni kahaba akakibia nyumbani kabia mama what has happened in this house akabwa bishop gatimo has anointed our house akamwambia now your god can kill me kill me nipokea i'm not going back akaokoka akawa mshirika wetu na wakapendana kama kama kilo wa SID nataka nataka ku toda eh. acha nikuombe ka hapo ni wambe sasa ndio muende eh, ni watoto wetu bwana sasa sana kama kilo wa SID what is that now the the family is very happy and they are very powerful i want to tell you the truth the holy spirit has your final say all other things will align in his will na kwa maana saa zingine mnasahau na nebu niwaambie mungu hana huruma na wasichana ambao is so special that god can overlook with us you have to repent kuna sana jua anavuta bangi ulivuta bangi wengine unakuta tu kuna mahali ulifanya masturbation for non grave una nini and then you stay as if wewe ni mtu mungu atahurumia tu hivi hivi tu kwa maana uko na sijini soprano sikiza mungu aweza kupiga mustana just as aweza kupiga bishop akikosea you need to repent and to rest the image of god na wambie bwana hata kama nilifanya ninatubu in a way kwa badamu ya yesu in rejeshe the image of god so that from today network yangu na kiti cha enzi irudi so that from today i will always be sensitive to the will of god and i tell you the truth i'm praying for you now damu ya kristo iingie kwa kila mmoja wenu na and from now hapa kutakuwa na harusi at God's timing in Jesus Christ name na hapa kutakuwa na progress ya career kuna kitu utaanza na utaifurahia na utaenda speed sana because whenever you step on your talent you move very fast and you prosper very fast amen na hii wakati unapotea wa ujana hautapotea your strength you beautiful nyinyi wasana mnajua beyond 20 years at least mtu akiwa na miaka 22 let's trust god you should be driving hata kama ni kakali kakali kale kana kako na 1000 cc kazuzuki kazuzuki au nini nataka kuwa kiniambia bishop nataka uje uombe nyumba yangu otherwise mutakuwa hivyo lini miaka katikati ya 20 and 40 ni miaka inaenda haraka sana haraka sana haraka sa amen and god makes way for you god make way for you god has network hallelujah you know the other day i called a lady in my office kambi ya dada yangu eh walikudanganya wanaume is gotcha tempted akapata mimba the same man comes later is very emotional oi si uko na mtoto wangu oi nani mwingine asipokuwa mimi una mtoto wanaoga kama muruya kama mukisi una mtoto wangu do you know something happened akaingia tena dada akapata mimba ya pili the man ran away Nikambia, can you please na kama akawa kama mpakawa nikamwambia i would like us to get you back to network we talked here 
we prayed 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 it worked do you know how god works wakati tunaongea hivyo yeah kuna batch of education somebody came on my way ni mtu ako karibu na ceo wa tsc kwa bishop uko na mtu ukitaka nipeleke ajiriwe i just got a certificate within one month or i think two months barua hata barua ilikuja hapa kabia already you are employed na kwa posted high school permanent na tsc nikabia my sister umerudi kwa network ure jamaa wa kuuza you know some people just reduce your value nikabia na kwa maana hata kama una watoto wawili if you don't defy yourself the way to meanza na wewe and god is moving you are going far and don't, nobody should come and tell you mimi ni baba hawa watoto mwambie na kija nipigie simu i can drive up to that place kuna watu sisi tu ni nyahunyoka na ndewe ndewe i don't know how how sasa nasikia kuna pesa na kuna joto anaweza rudi tena sema oi oi unajua nyinyi vya na mtu ambaye anajua uchi wako is very dangerous akiuza hivi utakuta anajua hizi vitu huku huku anasema nipitia utajikuta hui anajua ma, anajua ni wapi unaguzwa unayeyuka unaweka tu miguu vibaya gai yes habari yenu gai unajua mimi najua Mungu i know how he works na zikataka mukose network with god Bwana sio sana. Hallelujah. Can I pray for you? Same ni waombe because tuko na revival inaanza immediately. Nitawaombea mama tatu. And it will work. Mko tayari? Mko tayari? Eh, na mnazimama na style nzuri. Eh, it is a road for sisters. Oje dada kiamuka anagalia go vile go na ka. Si kama sisi tunapaka tu hivi. And everything is in order. Eh, unaangalia kama bag imebaki nyuma, unaangalia it's around. Lakini ukisha fauru sasa tulia. Na style. Mwingine anaangalia miguu kama ni ile. Don't worry you are great people. As long as I'm your bishop and pastor. The way I feel in my heart. You should not fail. Hallelujah. Unless you are not connected with the anointing that I feel in my heart. The anointing I feel in my heart should make you become what God said. All what me nahitaji ni ujitakase. Anything ambao ulifanya ikachafua au ikaagamiza network yako na Mungu. I just need you to be cleansed. The rest God you do make great things. Nataka munisubue sana. We ni kujo niambie bishop. The other day, there's a lady who came. Kambia na my, kambia na my sister. Nikapika simu. Nikapia mtu. Gentleman, I want to see. Nataka kusikia un madam ako Germany. Kambia, bishop. Alipo na kabua na madam kama ni bishop amekutuma it has to work i think she now she me only two weeks at the kazi germany na mshara ni mkubwa ni wambia ni subue just this. let us push things until we become somebody somewhere hallelujah hallelujah i always remember brother waroi she's now is now doing well in america i am a bishop bishop ika kitu kanaitwa green card unakajua kabia unatakaje i want to try kabia don't try do it pika magoti kamwambia within few days few weeks akaba bishop guy nimechukuliwa kabia yes on condition kabia enda lakini usiwe huko uje nipatie kasta na kamoja huko nimpatie kamoja now i sense in my heart we have never come closer with you in the level of anointing unanipata tu sadiki kuhubiria 
but I like to walk with you ni kuache umefaulu Bwana asifiwe unajua mtu ujijua si niwaambia a month ago nilipitia kanisa letu sama inaifasha just passing by and i sense ikasema in the name of jesus i destroy the strongholds of satan in aifasha just saying that pastor niambia nikiondoka a witch anakuwa ambia pastor kuna mtu amekanyanga hii kanisa huku tunaona pale alikanyaka kuna waka huu mtu ametuagamiza sana mimi hata sina shughuli kukanyanga tu kukanyanga tu akasema akaambia nikatimu akaambia hiyo jina ukitaja inatuua yes because we have network with god we we are destructive to the devil i would like to release that anointing on you lakini lazima uwe serious usiwe na mtu ambao ni munafiki if i can get a lady abo meamua kufauru i know I know in anointing to take you where God has called you to be. I know it. Sina shaka. Sina shaka. Sina shaka. Shida yangu if you come closer to me na una dhambi, mimi mimi usikia. Yes. If you come closer to me na umefa una dhambi hasa related to immorality. I don't have to ask you i don't know it happens immediately haya ukikubali utumbo ikiondoka mimi husikia na hiyo kitu bila shida sana na ukija na uwe hujajichafua i sense it ukija na unalaana inakufuata like family i can sense it in all these works we want to make you free because umeokoka na god loves you god knows you by the word of god my god i now raise every sister here to your presence and from today kama kuna dada alifanya kitu ikaribu the image of god the likeness of god na kakosa network with your throne Whatever happened I pray that God you forgive her and now the blood of Jesus cleanse her the blood of Jesus restore the network the blood of Jesus irejeshe yeye katika uwepo wako and from today my father kila msichana alia hapa kwa uwezo wa damu ya Kristo na kwa uwezo wa ushindi wa Kristo Areje kwa mpango wako what you planned concerning her kabla hujauba dunia i release it now from today iwe effective my father ninaondoa giza limitations of men and devil ninaondoa utumwa ninaondoa Guvu za ufame wa anga and now in Jesus name all these ladies be connected with you father wao wamefika wakati wa kuoa i declare breakthrough of glorious marriages wale ambao wanahangaika i now declare uwashike baba na waingize kwa karia na occupation umewachagulia wale baba wako hapa kila mtu bwana apokee the right gifting no more confusion no more staggering no wavering my father mupatie kila dada a gift mighty anointing to prevail over the world jesus do it Mungu wangu ninateganisha kila mtu hapa na laana za ukoo the patterns of curses in families i break them break them break them no one atafanana na watu wao wafanane na kile mugu uliwaasia na kawapangia kwa utukufu wa Bwana Mungu aliye hai damu ya Kristo iwafunike na iwadumishe in Christ we pray amen now sina muda wa kuendelea sana but I'll, I would like you to see me as your father, a 
as your mentor or a bishop tuingie line ya kukulea tuingie line ya kukulea na get time we meet and we pray get time that i raise you hata kama utanipa the next three years on how god what god you do kwa maana you are great na utaki uongo wa shetani na giza yake in any way iwazuie kuwa kile mungu aliwapangia thank god for meeting with you thank god for that sharing i just wanted today to share mambo ya kiroho about mungu anemenenea kwa husu and that god that you are available i know with all my heart kuna kitu kimefanyika na sina shaka damu ya yesu iwalide na wafunike god bless you god keep you